Well, looks like this is going to be a edited video now. Uh, I had to take a phone call. I didn't thought it was something to do with my surgery, but um, we just ended up getting that ulcerated tree spirit kill um, passively with all those other guys interfering. It kind of sucks that I didn't get the, the footage on that at the end, but I mean, I'll either upload this and not include it, sadly, or I will, um, you know, start to dabble with editing software at some point, and maybe I'll edit the two together, and I'll actually be able to show that part. But, uh, yeah, we got it done. Got it done. No major problems. I think I'm gonna have Dung Eater take out most of these guys. Dude, do you have to run right in the rot? Back to life. Alright, let's go. There you go. That got his blood pumping. He tried to attack me. a perfect parry. Go dong eater. Go dong eater. See, look, I, know, I knew you knew how to jump. If I had my footage from earlier, you guys would know how important that is. But I knew he knew how to freaking jump. Playing dumb during that whole boss fight. He basically, like, wouldn't jump up onto the platform with the boss. He just stayed in the Lake of Rod. Let's go, Dong here. Let's go. Oh. Box him in. Box him in. Box him in. Okay, let's go. Now that you're super buffed, kill the rest of these two guys. One easy peasy, no contest. Dung Eater versus a hundred kindred, ah, kindred of rot, and uh, Dung Eater would win. Oh, you're debuff now. Debuff now. <laughs> Kill it. What's up here? I don't even remember. Got 
Oh, right. Pointless dagger I'll never use. I don't think I've ever used any dagger besides Reduvia in this game. I really do want to make a build with the, um, the katana and the offhand dagger that's like a small katana. Because it does uh, power stance with katanas normally. Wait, what does Last Rites do on Golden Epitaph? Last Rites. Armaments are buffed 10%. 100% to undead types and prevent skeletons from reviving. In fact, attack power buff. Can it stack with other shit? I don't know if I should be adding that into my. I guess for certain bosses I probably should ain't that's like undead. The amount of times they make you get in coffins in these games, even in the first game. Alright, I have no idea how this shit's gonna go. I I truly do not. Alright, I thought there was a grace down here. Is there not a grace, like, right before this? I'm kind of surprised there's not. Like, okay, if there's no grace... Fuck that, then. Hold on. I need to go back here, and I need to get all my potions back, or my flasks. I only have two. Worth 5k apiece. That's 10k, that's 47, right? And I need 53. Trying to use as little as possible. Alright, 53 what? 53, 9, okay, I went all the way to 54 anyway. Oh, I think I'm gonna get another little health bump. Okay. Let's go get destroyed by Stell. I kinda don't think Dung Eater is gonna be the right uh, choice for Estelle. I feel like he's gonna be a little slow. Fuck. Come on, really? Pest threads are wild today. That's one of my freaking healing spells gone. Or my flask gone. But, like, I genuinely thought there was a. A freaking grace down here. Like, how is there not? I guess there's probably a, a stake of America or whatever. And... I'm just gonna use another one, I don't even care. I know he just starts blasting. Okay, he went for Dung Eater, not me. Wow. I gotta get up there though, so he stops doing that. It's 
those would connect, that would have been great. Oh, he does no damage. Come on, dude, we gotta get back up there. That's why I said he might not be the best. Like, somebody like Luthel at, like, level 10, the headless. I feel like he would be a lot better teleporting around and staying close. Well, if Dung Eater hits him in the head, he does decent damage. Sorry, right, buddy. Okay, you can't really run away from me. Doesn't help that he's not staying still and he's doing that shit over and over again. There you go. Fuck his face up. Got grabbed, though. We actually rolled that. Hey, what? Didn't explode. Just came right down and swooped his ass. What are you doing? You're blowing up again? I feel like this is the better buff to keep on him. And some golden bow. And some golden bow. Oh shit, I got hit by the third one. I'll be honest, Dung Eaters. Holding his own. I mean, it's a long process, but he's over here doing it. Damn, I blocked that meteor. Supposed to look at me like that. I'll fuck him in a wall. It's too far back. Close enough. Figure out where Dung Eater is. There he is. Tail Jabbies. There we go. I won't get bopped, but sorry.
is getting a little intense. Ooh! Almost tried to punch him in the face. He was just asking for it. Oh, dog. Every time Dung Eater gets close. Shit. And I was healing. I did not think he was going to do that twice in a row. Still, you gotta chill a little bit. This is getting, this is getting a little uh, excessive now. You were being a much better friend in the first half. Although I have no idea where Dung Eater is at this point, or what he's doing. Like, bro. Of course, as soon as he gets here, now he's all the way over there. This is like just as bad as Elden Beast. If not worse. I feel like Elden Beast is going to be a little easier actually. I have to be careful with what I heal him with. Gonna get knocked back. Oh, he dodged it. Oh, he got grabbed. Every time. This is not a fight I'm gonna wanna have to redo. You're so close, man. You're so close. It's literally it for my healing and my flasks. I've got what I've got. Come on, Dung Eater. Just make them swings, bro. Just make them swings. Make them swings. Don't let them go nowhere. Oh, fuck. Dung Eater, where you at? Dude, just kill him. Just kill him. Just go up there and kill him. Run up, run up and smack him. Yeah, there you go. No, but, but actually hit him. But connect. Okay, if you're gonna do your AoE shout thing. Yes! Thank you, Dung Eater. Thank you, bro. Jeez. I mean, you were not losing health to anything I was scared about. I just ran out of mana and <laughs> shit. That was good, though. That was good. Oh, shit. Yeah, I definitely need more mana. That's apparent. Alright, let's go... Get the ring from here.
Oh, I don't have the key. Wait a minute, what? Oh, tell me you get that for killing the Baleful Shadow. The Scarded Palace Key, I think it's called. Doing by Miniature Ronnie after defeating the Baleful Shadow, yeah. So I'm not gonna be able to get up to the rise. Unless there's a place I can rejection that Baleful Shadow. That's all I can think of. And, like, make it go off a cliff. Like, that's the only way I can, I can think of this being possible. I guess let's go try to find a platform to push him off of. I mean, unless maybe I have to send the elevator down and then push him down the elevator shaft? That's kind of what I'm thinking. I'm not seeing anywhere else here. So let's go send the elevator and then we'll go get him again. Alright, come here, dum dum. Not over there, over here. You are so slow. And now you're gonna get fast. Okay, I'm gonna try to like... Is he not gonna come over here? Wow. Wow, that actually worked. It was more of a challenge than I envisioned. Now I can finally I, I... stand before them. <laughs> this is farewell, my dear. Tell Bly and E.G. I love them. I don't know why I thought that wasn't going to work, but... I just didn't. I just didn't think it was. I don't think it was going to be that easy. So is EG still alive? Or is he gone now? Or is that when I put the ring on Ronnie's finger? Nah, he's still good. I want to talk to him one more time. Have you heard? Along the dark path of Empyrean, from Rena's rise, as she calls it. It would not have been possible without you. As Lady Rani's war counselor, and moreover, her childhood warden, I express my deepest gratitude. I love E.G. And only you were Lady Rani's true champion. My purpose is near. I've served Lady Rani. It has been a long. Now, Lady Rani, I pray that you serve. Lady Rani, along the now. Oh, okay, he's just gonna keep repeating himself. So. Uh, skills or spells? Skills, not spells. I'm still gonna buy it.
Alright, let's go give Ronnie her ring. Or no, we gotta get up to the rise first. And beat the dragon. See, I don't think there's gonna be any way for me to kill uh, Electo or whatever his name is that has Black Knife Tish as a summon, because, like, you can't summon inside of a, a Everjail. Grace, grace, grace. Right, so I guess the first thing I should try to do is this big ass dragon right here. Uh, let's go bow. I realize I still have mana left after that bow. <laughs> oh. Alright. A dragon supposed to be here? Don't know why. I thought the dragon was supposed to stop you from coming in here. Must have went the wrong way. Ah, that's I wanted to go over here. There it is. Now that all of our buffs are gone. Oof. He just did no damage with that swing. Oh, that did some damage, though. This Dagron needs to chill. <laughs> uh, Dung Eater's just too slow. I'm gonna need somebody faster for some of this stuff, like dragons. I have to kill that dragon to go inside here. <laughs> Come back and do it later. All the starlight shards. too many of these to pass up here and I'm gonna eventually have to start using them. Alright. Let's 
go down here. See if we need to kill that dragon to uh, progress this. Can't see. Well, we did it. The pacifist has finished Ronnie's quest. So, it was thee who would become my lord. Perhaps I needn't have warned thee. I am pleased, however. Thou art a fitting choice. I go now to the night sky. <laughs> it is there I shall find mine order. I bid thee travel the path of the lord. And once all is done, we shall see each other once more. Dark Moon Great Sword. This is a really badass sword. But you can mount up in here. Weird. Alright, well that's Ronnie's quest done. I mean, I still probably want some stuff up here. Um, I'm supposed to go to Windheim Ruins. Or Catacomb, I think. I think I was supposed to go here to get the, um... Wait, did I not? Did I finish this? I didn't finish this? I must have come in here real early for something and didn't, uh... Didn't have a summon that could kill this thing. Or I probably had, like, the rot dog at the time and it just didn't have the... the power to kill it, nor the... I don't think this thing could get rotted. Not even really bothering to heal him. I don't think he'll need it. Uh oh. <laughs> Put myself right in the way of that one. Come on, Dung Eater, get up. Yeah, explode with rage. Damn, that does so much damage. Like, I know he's overleveled for this, but... Oh, nice roll. Keeps using that sword with one hand and nothing in his other hand. Is he throwing? Is he throwing? No, oh, there he goes. Okay. Come on, last hit, Dung Eater. There you go. There we go. Glove Wart Picklers. Or Pickers. Picklers. I need to get these so I can have an easier time leveling up my alternate ashes as things start to seem like they are needing more versatile enemies. I mean, it might also just be a matter of like RNG, like I just need to keep doing it until I get lucky. I know, I, having more mana is, like, key right now. Let's just turn in all this stuff. 
shop's filling out pretty good. Alright. Well, that's going to be it today. We did some little odds and ends and got Ronnie's quest line done. We did a stell. A couple things. So, appreciate you watching. Take it easy, guys.